Time for a few more, a couple more, and we're going to be a little bit pressed here. Uh, let me go back here. Where's the gentleman in the Iron Fest? Yeah. I'd like to, to make a comment and, and a question too. One is on, on higher education. As a parent, I have two children involved. Uh, as a situation is, I can do things from being a elected official in Kingsborough and school committee, but also I was on board for two years. I've been a senior director of Thompson Writer, and myself and Dick Hugh, my staff, were laid off two and a half years ago. I just got back to work going back to health care back in, in June after being out of it for 10 years. My, my wife is still out of the later. So I know what it's like to try to pay the bills every, every month. I'm concerned for my kids with the amount of, you know, what the college education is costing these days, the two in college. Is there anything that would be coming down to helping with college loans, with, with anything like that? that could make it easy, because I'm concerned about the burden they may have in that, too, going forward. Well, we, the House of Representatives, one of the things I enjoyed about President Obama's speech the other night was he acknowledged the many pieces of legislation that the House of Representatives has passed. And one significant piece was around higher education, truly recognizing what a great burden this is on families, and uh, expanding the loan pool, expanding uh, the uh, changing the way in which loans are, are administered. Currently, they're in the private sector. Many banks uh, administer that process. They do um, great fees uh, to the detriment of somebody like you or your daughter who's trying to borrow money. So we change the system, make it government run, bring down the cost, uh, and make it more affordable uh, for you and other families across this country. An important piece of legislation, and we're looking uh, to the Senate to move it ahead and finally.